So just making a video here to show the uh, various uh, pieces of the uh, turbo compounded uh, Briggs uh, turbine. Um, as you can see here the the turbine there wants to roll around, does it? It's got 26 blades. It's made from an exhaust valve, stainless steel exhaust valve. Guess I'm going to have to hold on to it there. Show you it there. I uh, made it basically with uh, using a lathe to cut it down uh, square, if you will, and then uh, using a Dremel, cutting it by hand. Basically, I uh, drew up in CAD templates of various uh, numbers of uh, fins, and then uh, chose the 26 one. Glued that on the, the back end there, and used that for my uh, guide, and then uh, was able to machine it. So, here's a view of uh, the main uh, drawing I did. Uh, you can see the uh, turbine here, and the cone extension. Have it machined here, in there like that. And you have the outer housing. The outer housing here. It's this big guy with the tangential inlet there. He's kind of hollow there. And you have the bushing carrier here tube with a brass bushing in it that the shaft uh, rides in uh, oil lube and a uh, shaft collar to stop the shaft there and uh, inlet pipe to uh, feed the exhaust to it and then uh, in this area here you have a filler piece that's this uh, ramp shaped piece here my son uh, suggested I add it. I was just going to uh, have a cavity there, but uh, seeing this kind of uh, 3D drawing here, gases come in at a tangent and swirl around. And so basically, on this guy, they with the right finger here come in this way and then swirl up and around as well as at the same time that they're coming towards the camera. So uh, yeah, anyways, just a show a few of the little sketches and drawings there that I did on this to uh, make sure that I got it to correct orientation and things and I eventually drew it up on uh, CAD there just to show a few of the important dimensions and things but so uh, basically uh, give me a second here and I'll uh, assemble it slide it into the casing So once it's assembled and running, you won't be able to see this. You see the tangential inlet there, and then I've got the, the like spiral shaped ramp in there. And the turbine slides in. And these are a little bit of a tight fit, so they don't necessarily want to go. But, so there we go there. The turbine sits in there like that. And then this cone here is held in uh, place uh, away from the turbine there with enough clearance. And then of course the uh, inlet pipe gets coped out and uh, welded on there to uh, to feed it. Let's see it there. Anyway, just uh, wanted to make a video there of the various pieces of the uh, turbo compound turbine there. Uh, before I uh, weld things together and, and assembled them there. So, anyway, I uh, hope uh, you like the project, and at this point in time, I uh, hope it uh, works long enough to make a video out of it.